of volunteers that are here today. We have some that are working in the library and they're helping us sort out one of our storage rooms, they're helping us shift some of the books around, and they're also helping us clean up some of the shelves. Well the library they only have a certain amount of people that can work so we're doing stuff that they really can't get to because they have a lot more stuff to do on their hands. So we're just filling in the lost help. Then we have a second group that's working outside and they're weeding and cleaning out flower beds and planting some new flowers so it'll really make the outside of the library look a lot more beautiful. I chose to do this so I can help my community look better and make it look like a more clean and safe place and enjoyable for other people. The work that the seniors are doing today is going to be really helpful for the library just because it's a lot of the tasks that we don't always have people on hand to get to. Things like sorting out our storage room, it's going to be really helpful just because we don't have enough staff to do that sort of work. Also outside, the garden is going to look beautiful and it's going to be just a real improvement for the grounds. I feel good about the activities we're doing because we're helping out the community and it's just I feel good for helping. First we was doing the little garden work at the Mallow Library over there. Mallow Library. Planting flowers and stuff. Now we washing the cop car, police pig. Washing cars for the Mallow. Attack! <laughs> planting flowers here at Harrington Middle School today on this beautiful day. Um, <laughs> planting trees, flowers. This was actually mostly done when we got here. We did more of the trees and stuff along the line. We had to dig the holes from over the soil to get it like loosened up and then we would start digging holes for to plant the trees and the rest of the bushes. Uh, we decided to work here because we went to this middle school, we attended here, and um, we thought it would be cool to like make the scenery better and stuff and help out as much as we could. So.
Lakers, we spray painted, as shown, um, some of the fences because the paint was starting to chip, and we uh, laid down some new gravel along the warning track in uh, a couple fields. And before this, we were at Jacob's Chapel helping out their gardens, um, making everything look a little bit nicer. Well, I mean, I've been playing baseball my whole life, so I mean, I figured I'd give back to the community a little bit, for, especially for baseball. So I helped out the field a little bit, and then since I signed up for this, I also went over to Jacob's Chapel. That was kind of indirect, but either way, it was still awesome. Well, I'll tell you what, this was the final phase of a group of workers who I got to take my hat off to here in 2012 on the senior day of service. The gentleman that worked at Jacob's Chapel this morning, starting at 9 o'clock, and did an extraordinary job weeding the beds, cutting out the beds, uh, you know, trimming bushes, planting flowers. They uh, did a nice job there at Jacob's Chapel. They then came here in the afternoon. Um, they added red soil or, or gravel to the warning track of this particular field here. Um, they went around and spray painted all of the green fence posts in this complex, which is a beautiful Mount Laurel complex. And uh, a handful of guys, and I gotta put my, my two cents in here, Paulie, Seth, and those gentlemen, that whole group did an extraordinary job whitewashing the, uh, the concession stand area. Okay, so these guys, I have to tell you, and I'll, I'll put it out there, were probably the hardest working crew that came out here on the senior day of service, and uh, I think they did a great job. <laughs> no reason to stay everywhere. I earned this sandwich. <laughs> I went over with a group of kids to Mount Laurel Library and we planted a bunch of flowers and cleaned up the back of this area. It was dedicated to a, a director of the library. And we also went over and washed the Mount Laurel police cars, helped with the senior citizen area over there, so we did quite a bit. I went over to uh, Harrington Middle School to, uh, we did some landscaping, we put in new flower beds and uh, bushes. Uh, we did a lot of digging. Um, but uh, it helped, it was kind of like a whole beautification thing. We cleaned out weeds, we did all sorts of stuff for it. It was, it was a lot of fun. I chose Larchmont just because I really wanted to work with kids and I like working with kids and I think they really enjoyed having high school kids there to hang out with them during gym and recess and I think they had a lot of fun and I know we did. I stayed here, I played with little kids from Camden. We did some fun activities, we had some relay races. We just bonded as a team. I think we came together as a group, as a family, met some new people, really enjoyed my day. Uh, we've been working on it in class a lot and that's just, we had set plan for our senior day of service to go there and put the play on for all the elementary schoolers, so. Today we went to Medford Lee's and we made the day some possibly lives of 50 elderly women by charming them with our singing and dance moves. We entertain them all afternoon through the majesty of song and dance. Uh, we went to Larchmont School and we had, um, we had, they had a fun fest tonight so we had to do like organizing all of their prizes for like winning the fun fest and all the activities and stuff. Um, what else did we do? Uh, we played kickball with the kids. They had a lot of fun doing that. <laughs> yeah, we also played like hand games at recess and like we did a lot of fun stuff with them. They were really excited about it. Well, uh, I helped supervise, uh, you know, we had some of our kids, they were working over at uh, Jacob's Chapel. They were doing some landscaping, cleaning up some shrubbery. And then we went over to uh, Laurel Acres, to the baseball fields, spray painted the fences, raked up the outfield. Uh, you know, again, just kind of cleaning it up and trying to give back to the community, trying to encourage that among the seniors in the class of 2012 at Lenape High School.